Welcome back to Drive Through Math. In this episode, we're going to talk about finding the distance between two points using the Pythagorean theorem on the coordinate plane. Here we have two points. We have one at quadrant one, which is one comma eight, and the other at quadrant four, six comma negative four. So we're going to do a series of steps to find the distance between these two points. So just follow along. The first thing that I would do is draw a line connecting those two points, and then we're going to create a right triangle. Now, we're going to go ahead and label these points. I'm going to label this one A, this one B, and we're going to create a third point for over here, and we're going to label that point C. Now, let's go ahead and find the ordered pair for point C, which is going to be at 1, negative 4. So what we want to do now is find the distance of the two shorter legs, which is the distance from A to C and the distance from C to B. And once we have those two short legs, it'll allow us to find the distance of A to B. So we go ahead and find the distance from C to B. Now, if you notice, that's a horizontal distance. That's just a side to side distance. So we're going to use our X values because our X values represent a horizontal shift. Now, the distance between the number one and the number six is going to be five units. So that means that the distance from C to B is five. Now we're gonna go ahead and do something similar and find the distance of um, point C to point A. And we notice that that's an up and down distance, so it's a vertical distance, and we use the Y values for that. So we go ahead and use our Y values, which are negative four and positive eight. Now the distance from negative four to positive eight if you think about it, it takes negative four, four units to get to zero, and eight units to get from zero to eight. And together, that's a total distance of 12. So that is my distance for um, the, uh, C to B. So we're gonna go ahead and write that as 12 right over here. Now we're gonna plug the information in into the Pythagorean theorem, which is A squared plus B squared is equal to C squared. So um, A and B are the two shorter lengths, and the hypotenuse is the, the C, which is always directly across the right angle, which happens to be here in our drawing. So I'm going to go ahead and use 5 for A, and use 12 for B, and solve what we can. 5 squared is equal to 25, 12 squared is equal to 144, and we're saying that those two added together are equal to C squared, and 25 plus 144, 25 plus 144 is equal to 169. And we're saying that 169 is equal to C squared. Now, in order to get rid of that, um, that um, exponent of a two, we're gonna go ahead and find the square root of both sides. So once we do that, these two cancel out. And all we need to do now is find the square root of 169, which happens to be 13. So we can say that 13 is equal to C. And there you have it. We can write that in into our problem. And the distance from A to B is 13 units. Catch you on the next episode.